How to install MIUI 12.0.3.0 stable build on the POCO F1 without any data loss. Hey peeps, what's up? Manchi here, back with another video. And in this video, I'm going to show you how you can install MIUI 12.0.3.0 official stable build on the POCO F1 without any data loss. As you can see, I do have the POCO F1. Right now, I am on MIUI 12.0.2.0 based on Android 10. Now, in case you want to have a look at the new and missing features of MIUI 12.0.3.0, we do have a separate video for that, which can be found in the description and in the pinned comment on this video while we're talking about the pinned comment i do recommend that you read it because it does have some very important information now what are the prerequisites for this video well for starters make sure your battery is charged at least 50 to 60 percent next up we can go into the gallery application and as you can see i do have two pictures here one is of my chicken friend and the other one is of lord vader and this is my desktop setup or my home screen setup right now i'm telling you this so that you can keep an eye out and we can make sure that we did not have any data loss now what are the files which you need well that depends on what version of miui you are on right now so let me open file manager we can go to the different view and then we can go into more and select archives once we are in archives you will see that we have two files over here so the first file is around 2.11 GB on my phone. This is the full ROM file. If you are on MIUI 11, MIUI 10, MIUI 9, you need to use the full ROM zip file, which is this one. If you are on MIUI 12.0.2.0, then you need to use the second file, which is your block OTA file. And this one is smaller. This one is around 380.24 MB on my device. So again, let me repeat myself. 12.0.2.0, use the block OTA file. Anything other than that, use the full ROM file and those of you who have dwrp recovery you also need to use the full rom file and then you can follow the video which is linked in the pinned comment of this video so based on what version of miui you are on you will download only one of these two files next thing you need to do is you will go into settings and then we'll go into about phone tap on the miui version it's going to check for an update if you get the update you can install it from here in case you do not then you need to tap on the 12 a few times you'll get a message that additional update features are on then you will tap on the three dot menu on the top right and go into choose update package now those of you who are on miui 11 you will go into settings about phone system and then it is going to check for an update if you get the update feel free to download it if you do not then again you have to tap on 11 a few times till you get the message that additional update features are on then you will tap on the three dot menu on the top right and select choose update package and that should open this file manager or file explorer application right next thing you need to navigate to the folder where you have downloaded the zip file which is linked in the description of this video do note that in case you download the file on your phone directly it will be in the download folder in my case, I have transferred it manually, so it is in the root directory of my internal storage. Now, a question which I get a lot is that are the links of the files which you have provided in the description, are they safe? Yes, the links are from Xiaomi's servers directly. The process which we are using is going to verify the integrity of the file. So make sure you have an active internet connection as well. Next question which I get a lot is I haven't gotten the update. Well, updates are rolled out in batches. Not everybody gets them at the same time and that is something which is controlled by Xiaomi and Poco. Either you wait for them or you can follow this process and update manually. Another frequent comment is oh I didn't get the update. The update has rolled back. Well, that's not how it works. Just because you haven't gotten the update doesn't mean it is rolled back. If 
the phone allows us to update after Xiaomi has verified the file then it is not rolled back which is why I highly encourage you to read the pinned comment on my videos next up now that we are on the file manager application all you need to do is select the file which you had downloaded for the purpose of this video I am going to use the full ROM file however those of you who are on 12.0.2.0 you can use the smaller block OTA file once you have selected the file tap on OK and there it is you can see it is going to get some information about the file and we are now getting a message that your device will reboot automatically and update to MIUI 12.0.3.0 and in case it is going to erase the data it is going to give you a warning about that we did not get any such warning so our data will not be erased all you need to do is select reboot and update and as you can see it is now decrypting the file and at this point it is going to connect to Xiaomi's servers make sure the file is not tampered with in any way and everything is fine with the file once that is done the device is going to reboot automatically and apply the update so there it is as you can see the update is being applied on my device right now and again make sure you do not turn off your device while the update is being applied which is why i do mention that make sure your battery is charged at least 50 to 60 percent because if your battery is at say five percent ten percent the phone turns off during the update you might have a brick now once the phone has updated or the update has been applied successfully the device will boot back into MIUI. Back into MIUI we can unlock our device as you can see my wallpaper hasn't changed. We can go into the gallery application we still have the pictures which we had my friend chicken and Lord Vader. Then we can go into settings about phone bam here it is. MIUI 12.0.3.0 based on Android 10 updated successfully without any data loss and of course I did forget that I had two applications which were pre-installed on 12.0.2.0 which were DRM info and activity launcher and those applications are still present which again means there was no data loss and of course if you see the lag this is nothing new welcome to MIUI lag city and those of you who want to know whether Prime HD issues have been fixed in this build or not, the answer is unfortunately no, those issues haven't been fixed. And there it is peeps, that is how you update your POCO F1 to MIUI 12.0.3.0 official stable build based on Android 10 without any data loss and that will do it for this video. Hope my video helped you, likes, shares and subscribes are appreciated feedback and comment more than welcome see you when i see you